There are various reasons why you may want to change your privacy settings on LinkedIn, whether you're a job seeker who's trying to job search passively or you're a business owner who doesn't want your leads to know that you're looking at their profile. There are different reasons why you may want to change your privacy settings. In this video, I'm going through three different privacy settings that you can consider to update on your LinkedIn profile to help with your overall privacy and visibility. So let's get right into it. The first one is how much of your LinkedIn profile can people see? If people are not connected with you on LinkedIn, how much of your profile can they actually see? And so how do you know that? Firstly, what you're going to do is as you open your LinkedIn uh, profile, you will click right here where it says public profile and URL. You'll click on this little pencil here. It's going to take you to this page. And on this page, you are able to see how much of your LinkedIn profile do you want to make public? And this means if anyone goes on any search engine, whether Google or Bing or whatever they may be using, how much of your profile do you want them to be able to see without being connected to you on LinkedIn? And so you are able to adjust those settings here. So for example, you can see on this profile, all the person can see if they are not connected to me on LinkedIn is they can see the headline and they're able to see the basic information from the name, number of connections and followers. And that's pretty much it. They can't see recent experience. They can't see past experience. If I had more sections on this LinkedIn profile, they wouldn't be able to see that as well. But if I decide I want to change that, it is something that I can turn on. And by turning that on, people are able to see more sections of my profile. So this is a choice that you can make of how much of your LinkedIn profile do you want to make public to those who are not directly connected with you on LinkedIn. Okay, so now we're going back to where we were previously, the main page on LinkedIn. We're going to talk now about the second privacy setting. And this is, for example, if you want to view someone's LinkedIn profile, but you you don't want them to know that you viewed their LinkedIn profile. So this is how you will make that adjustment. You'll click up here on me right at the top and then you'll go to settings and privacy. By clicking on settings and privacy, you will see that it'll take you to this page with quite a bit of options and you will then select visibility right here. From there, you will see that there's the first option under visibility of your profile and network. There's profile viewing options. You are going to click on that. As you can see here for this person, if they go on someone else's LinkedIn profile, the person is able to know that they viewed their profile. They're going to be able to see their name and their headline. If you want to change this, that you don't want someone to know that you viewed their LinkedIn profile, you can change either to private profile characteristics, which is just going to give a description of who you are. So for this person, it says customer service specialist and what field they're in and the city. But if you're in an industry that is quite unique, or if you're looking at someone who may know who you are just based on that description that has happened to me quite a bit where people choose this privacy setting but because i know them i'm, I'm like yeah they, <laughs> i know who you are uh so if that's the situation just go straight to private mode and in private mode all it's going to say is anonymous linkedin member so when the person goes on their profile and they're trying to see who has viewed their linkedin profile all they're going to see is anonymous linkedin member all right our third privacy setting Setting. And this one is one of the privacy settings and reasons why a lot of people will decide sometimes not to make any updates or any changes to their LinkedIn profile. I will say that a few years ago when you were on LinkedIn, if you made any change to your profile, updating your experience, updating your education, it would give a notification to everybody, which was super annoying. So the settings on LinkedIn have changed. That is not the default setting anymore, but you want to still make sure that your privacy settings are on 
or off when it comes to people knowing the changes that you're making to your LinkedIn profile or your birthday, work anniversary, all that. All right, so going back to visibility where we were previously, you're going to scroll down and go to share profile updates with your network. So as you can see here, it's already off. So should we notify your network of key profile changes, new job, education certificate, profile video or anniversary? No, if you don't want that, then you want to make sure that this is off and that will be the way that people will not get notifications when you make updates to your LinkedIn profile or if you're celebrating a work anniversary or if you make a change in your job. So instead, when you want to make these announcements, you can do so as you choose when you create LinkedIn posts, but it will not do so automatically for you. On that note, there is other ways that you can make sure that your LinkedIn profile is viewed just by certain people. And that setting is by blocking people. I have another video where I go into detail about how to block or unblock someone on LinkedIn. You can click right here to watch that video. I'll see you there.